The FDA authorized emergency use authorization for two COVID vaccines for kids as young as six months old. Well, I think it's wonderful that we have a vaccine available for children now. So those are the kids that can be protected and they can also protect those around them. It'll help our herd immunity. Dr. Lisa Green says although to medical professionals this is good news, the urgency to get children under five vaccinated should be higher, but is not. I kind of feel there's less of an urge by parents to get vaccines right now for their kids, especially COVID vaccine. Because because things are opening up, they assume that COVID's over and that we're just done with this and even though COVID's not done with us. Saying the importance of getting this age group vaccinated is dire as they are left without any other protection. The children go to school, they go to daycare, they're getting sick from other kids and COVID's spreading like other colds. So they're getting sick too and some of the kids may get seriously ill. Dr. Grant Paulson is a site investigator for the vaccine clinical trials at Children's explaining to those who are hesitant to get their infants and toddlers vaccinated to think of what could happen without it. Really the only treatment option for those young children is an IV infusion that is once a day for between three and five days or longer if they're critically ill. Once given the vaccine, those in the trial experienced expected side effects. The more systemic side effects that we're seeing more commonly were fatigue, irritability, fussiness, headache occasionally.